Hey everyone, welcome back to some Rogue Tower, and look at this in the top left, run version 4.20.69. Yep, that's right, the game received a patch yesterday, um, which as I'm sure you can imagine was an April Fool's Day patch. It was quite, it was quite funny actually, the patch notes went something along the lines of um, the Shredder received absolutely no change, uh, and... Uh, what else was it like stuff like the uh the frost keep is no longer frosty which i kind of found quite funny oh i really should have positioned those better actually in between all the other houses why well, my ballist is so expensive already what why are they so expensive what's happened am i losing my mind I actually like lost my mind. What's going on? Okay, we're gonna get an early obelisk. Okay. I don't know what's happened. Is that correct? I kind of want to restart. We, we can demolish them in between rounds. Actually, let's, let's do that. Let's demolish them in between rounds. Oh wait. Dude, did you see how fast they just fired? What? Uh, what? They're rapid. They made ballistas rapid. Look at it go. They like reduce the range, maybe. Oh. Okay. Um. Let's get park or cannon down early as well. Although right now I'm kind of just struggling to get any kind of ballista down. This is insane. This is actually insane. So they've made them hella expensive, but they made them rapid. Maybe this isn't the way to go anymore at the start, because I've just wasted like five rounds here. <laughs> Honestly, though, look at them go. Oh my god, this is going to be so much more fun. I can't figure out why it's doing this. It must be a change. I didn't see it in the patch notes. Unless they've actually, oh my god, is it actually like an April Fool's patch where the things actually exist? Do you, do you know what I mean? Uh, let's get another ballista upgrade. Okay, I'm gonna get, uh, I'm gonna put a ballista in there. This is insane to me. Okay, he actually doesn't do a lot on his own, does he? He's killed one at least, two. Okay, nice, three. I'll do. I'm, I'm amazed by this. I thought the patch was actually a joke. I didn't read any patches about ballistas, to be honest. It could have said ballistas are now super speedy or something. Okay. Um, all ballistas deal one damage to armor. Yes, that's what we need the most. Okay. Well, I, I don't really know what to do at this point. I could sell a bunch of those, but I don't want to because the money. Because obviously the money they get from houses. I know we get a full refund back, but I like the money I'm getting from houses right now. I think it'll be fine if we can just get a few more around here, you know. Get one here next, I think. Yeah, definitely need one here next. And we could just upgrade the ballistas as well, don't forget, which I, I'm likely to do very soon. I'm going to get some more positions down first. Okay. All ballistas deal 25% more bleed damage. I'm aware there's other towers here, but it's, I'm going to be honest. It's all about the ballistas right now. It's all about the ballistas right now. Now, somebody actually mentioned to me that um, you get a... Is it, you get a split amount, an even split of enemies from each of the pathways... So, oh, what was it again? So something like in the last video when I really struggled at the end with that, that one path was like overrunning my entire operation. They said if, if you'd have just left that alone instead of kept extending it, you'd probably been better off. Which I'm kind of intrigued by. How are we doing down here? Are we going to make this? I think we are. Okay. Nice. That's huge. All ballistas deal another one damage to shields. Okay. Let's put another ballista down here then. 
I wanted to put that there because we're going to put a ballista or ballistas around this house. 690 now per ballista though. That's insane. That's actually insane. Fire rate, 200 RPM. I wonder if you can upgrade that. That'd be very nice. Let's upgrade this one right here a little bit though. Let's make this one like an absolute unit. He do be kind of shredding to be fair. Okay, he's level 10, right? So let's leave him at level 10. Um, I'm going to get... The, no, actually, I'm going to get the test. The, the, the thing is starting to update. The obelisk is starting to update. Okay, so he's level 10. I want to get this one level 10. I, I need to get more down, though. It's kind of the issue. That's the problem now. There's no cheap turrets anymore because... Well, why would they be cheap? You know, they're actually good now. Like, it's going to make it a lot harder. Also, you're going to be able to apply, like, the... The dot stacks a lot more. The bleed, the poison, and the... The fire, the burn. Right, you can just keep stacking like. Oh, this ballista down here, dude. He shreds armor. Look at him go. Still some tanky units coming in though, which is a bit of a worry. I think we'll be fine. Hopefully. No, that guy's tanky. Oh, he died though. Increased range would be good. All ballistas deal free damage to health. Yes. Okay, I can almost afford a new one. It's going to go right there. Once we manage to kill somebody. But it's going to take us ages to kill one because they're miles away. Here we go. Nice. But this one needs to be upgraded as well. As much as possible, really. Try and get them all to level 10, I think, to start with. Not when I say all, I don't mean these ones. I just mean the, the kind of like the main three right now, you know. Dude, this is such a weird change. I wonder if they've actually changed the other towers as well. I'm so happy that I logged into play this when I did, just in case it is an April Fool's patch. Something tells me it's not, and I've just missed a really important patch. All ballistas slow enemies for 5% of the damage they deal. Absolutely. That's that's huge. Lots of houses as well that I need to, you know, fill. But I just can't because there's no towers. I can't afford towers anymore. Okay, he's level 10. Let's start upgrading this one down here then. But this guy's dealing damage up there now as well. Look at him go. This guy's level 10. Okay, nice. Let's save it for a new one then, I think. We need to get some other towers down for sure, but they're all a thousand gold, so why would I right now? You know, why would I do that? Okay, nice. All ballistas deal burn damage. Absolutely. Once again, that's a yes from me. Okay, still no upgrades. I'm trying to afford some, you know, another ballista. Or even maybe a, an obelisk or something to go in the middle. Uh, don't know yet. But like more ballistas are going to be good just because we've got the slow thing now and they fire so quick and, you know, we can just upgrade them and that'd be really helpful. We need to figure out which our longest pass is going to be. It's going to be this one, right? So you want to upgrade this one next and then not that one. And that'll be the longest one. Okay. So our next ballista needs to go there, ideally. So the burn's going to help a bunch as well. I can't quite get over this. I've been saying for ages, I really want the ability to like upgrade the ballista's speed. And now they've just done it for me. It didn't even cost me anything. I love it. Go on. That's it. Nice. Well played. We've got enough for an obelisk. We do have enough for an obelisk. I'm going to get the um, all obelisks deal plus one to shield. And I'm going to put the obelisk on here. We're going to expand this way. Oh my god. 
the range on that. Wait, is that changed? Is that the artwork's changed on that as well? That covers a massive area. Okay, I'm not going to upgrade it yet because I want to get a ballista down here first. Just help with the slow of the Oogie next round. Dude, what's going on? I've actually missed, like, really... Are they hidden, like, really important patch notes underneath the April Fool's patch notes? Kind of feels like that. This is so confusing. Right, let's get you down there. We don't want to extend this way because this will be the longest path. So this is the one, this is the one that we want the Oogie to walk down. Okay. Honestly, I need, I need the ballistas, yeah. Feel poison damage. They now do all three dots, which is nice. We're going to expand this way. Oh, how did the Oogie... Well, that's not the longest one. Well, that's ruined my entire plan. Um, you know, you can stay there. I've said that you should be focusing the Oogie now. Oh, we got no mana. Oh, my God. 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 Oh my god, we've got no mana. Oh, we've got no mana. We've got no mana. We've got no mana. We've got no mana. Uh, I am such an idiot. It is just a healthy Yugi though, luckily. So we can just get this ballista to target most health and just keep upgrading, I hope. To be fair, we've almost killed him anyway. Look at that. That was easy enough. Okay, I need mana, like, next card upgrade, please. Look at the range on this, though. Uses free mana per shot, doesn't it? Fire stupidly quick. Okay, there is no mana thing, so we're just going to get all ballistas deal 25% poison damage. Oh my god, look at the... Is that literally nowhere to put a tower? There's, like, free spaces to put a tower over there. This is hilarious to me. Oh, we should have got this as well. Mana? No. Right, like, honestly, let's start to get banditry then, right? They're going to drop more money now. Which I can live with. I'm going to get a... Uh, a ballista down there. Nice. Just to, you know, help out with the whole house situation. This is so weird. I can't believe the obelisk change actually is the most interesting. More than the, the house changes. I want to try everything else now. This is this is wild. <laughs> oh no, the shields are in place. They haven't got any shield modifiers on these guys. I have to get those into play next, I think. Yeah, definitely, actually. Yeah, we desperately need the shield modifiers up. It's going to cost us a lot to upgrade all of them, but we'll get there. Oh, we didn't even upgrade that one. Oops. Oh, I was upgrading that one the whole time. On top of the hill. I was. Uh, oops. <laughs> okay, this guy needs shield upgrades. Oh my god, okay, nice. We managed to get through that all okay. Um, generate mana through the magic of the magic market. We're going to have to get that, aren't we? I was hoping that was going to turn in. Another graveyard that's actually full. What the hell is going on? Okay, mana banks. At least they stay at 500 by the looks of it. Okay, they do. Nice. We can start to generate a little bit of mana now, maybe. <laughs> Only a little bit. I'm going to get that shield damage up. It's most important to me right now. Don't care about the mana too much. I feel like this obelisk isn't playing that big of a part compared to all of our, our um, ballista friends. I'm aiming to get the, the shield multiplier to 10 on all these ballistas. All bits any free at the minute but we'll get to we'll get all them done soon look at this man this is what we're gonna need poison shredders maybe i don't know i feel like we're doing okay the fact that we haven't even got over a thousand yet on the ballistas is kind of funny but
Okay, nice. Um, regenerate 1% of your max mana per second. We're going to have to get that, I'm afraid. We just need to help right now with the situation. This new gravestone thing is insane. This is going to change everything. They're making the towers stronger, so you need to use less towers. Is that the, the plan here? Okay, that's got 10 shield damage now. That one's got 10, so it's this one next. How are we getting along? Okay. Nice. We're shredding enemies. Obviously, I want to get more mana banks. I might do that after I upgrade these ballistas, to be fair. Focus on the mana. It's just so the obelisk can function. Maybe we're going to need to get a lot more mana in place, you know? Like uh, siphons and, um, I don't know, upgrades, lifesteal and all that kind of stuff, I guess. The ballistas do seem to be dealing a decent amount now to the, poise, uh, to the shield. Sorry, look. Oh, that's so good. It's actually so good. I'm going to get a mana bank at the end of this. Another one. We just need to get this, you know, flowing. So the obelisk can actually beam people instead of just being a little, like, pea shooter at the minute. Oh, the range on it's ridiculous. <laughs> okay, nice. Now, I know what you're all thinking. Oh, they'll be good. I need mana right now. I'm sorry, everybody. I need mana more than anything else right now. So that's what we're going for. If this comes down here, that would be huge, actually. We can actually afford another mana bank in a second as well. Ooh, we need mana siphons, dude. We've got so many crystals laying about. Look at him do his thing. He does target most health, which... I'm just going to let him target whatever he wants at this point, to be fair. Okay, more mana banks needed for sure, for sure. Um, do I want to put one there? So you can put siphons there. Definitely put one there. We get some money. Okay, nice. We are generating mana now, but there isn't as many things to shoot, I guess, but no. Nah. Showing promise, showing real promise here though. Dude, this is this is insane. <laughs> this is actually insane. I need to get other towers down, but I need to sort out the mana situation. We've only got one obelisk and our mana's getting shredded, so it's obviously gonna be a big issue. Here we go. Now I do like all of these things. Actually, it's shield damage, dude. We need shield damage. I'm so sorry. We need shield damage. This is gonna run past this thing of ballistas. Although the range isn't that great, actually. Okay, so I've been, I've been getting some better ballista range, you know, put in place. Let's go ahead and get some more mana banks, guys. Let's do it. It's going to be siphons. That's going to be... Okay, yeah. So there, I guess, is the next one. Cool. Look at the mana. I don't know how we can function like this anymore. Wait, if we put it next to... Oh, you don't get protected by it? Okay, I suppose that makes sense. Just put them down here or something. I want this to be full throughout the whole battle. That's the goal here. So I'm making this the longest path at the minute. So if we increase the range on these, this will be a good one for the Oogie to walk down. But look at the gravestones. I can't get over it. We can, we can put some more down, but I feel like I don't need to right now. Like I could just buy some more ballistas or upgrade some stuff, you know. Here we go. I'm going to go sorcery free. I know the other ones could have been better, but let's try it. Let's keep expanding this one. Okay, some ballistas can reach. That's actually really nice. But some ballistas can reach. That'd be a good spot for a ballista actually on there. Let's upgrade him a little bit. I let's upgrade him a lot. Yeah, look at that go. Go on, Ballista. Do your thing. See, I'm hoping he's going to deal like a lot of damage to the Oogie when the Oogie comes down this path. Hence why I believe it's worth upgrading him. 
Okay, that's great here. How are we doing on the rest of the field? Oh, they're getting past this section again. In a little while. We've got our mana situation though. That's nice. Definitely want some shredders next, I think, because they don't cost any mana, and I'd like to see if they've changed. Although it did say in the uh, April Fool's patch notes that uh, uh, shredders received absolutely no change. So maybe that one's the only true one in the patch notes. We'll see as soon as I can get it. Obviously, I'm going to value all the other upgrades first. This ballista hasn't been upgraded, but he's still going to deal damage. And the obelisk kind of comes into play right there. Well, okay, honestly, heavy shafts. Yeah, let's get the ballistas upgraded. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my god, it does turn. Oh my god, it turns. Oh my god, it spins. It turns. You know what that means? We need to get more ballistas like in these positions. Not only is it next to a house, it's also going to be able to deal loads of damage. Oh, if this actually wraps around like that, I'll cry. That make me so happy if that's the case. Obviously, they're not upgraded, but I don't really want to upgrade these ones. I just want them to be there. How's that house is doing? 22%. Not as much as usual, purely because we can't spam ballistas everywhere. By the way, we can afford a particle cannon now, but I don't think... Actually, I should probably utilize it, shouldn't I? I want to put it on a plus three spot though that covers a lot of land. I'm gonna go for there. Oh my god. The sheer size of this unit. Has he always been I feel like he hasn't always been that big. He fires a lot quicker though. What's going on? Right, you have the most towards shields. So you're gonna target most shields. Mig is gonna upgrade that. Okay, ballistas, I they cannot consume mana because that will kill me. Uh, I'm gonna get enemies drop two gold. So banditry two. Oh my god, it continues round. This is so good for us. Please wrap to the left, please. Please. I can't I can't believe this. Why is this? This is dude, they've actually made so many changes. I was literally just saying the other day, like I can't wait for the next update and look at it. Alright, it's time for more ballistas, and I'm gonna be honest, I want them on houses you know i want them around houses dude I want, I want these at least 10 so okay nice more money from houses more ballistas more slows more dots more everything more damage look at our mana situation since we've added the particle kind of those i guess he does fire quite fast so we're back to sorting out the mana situation next um, all ballistas slow enemies for an additional 5%. It has to be done. It has to be done. Oh my god, it will go to the left. Oh my god. This is insane. Right, it's mana bank time though. Let's get mana bank sorted first. Probably shouldn't put these here now because we want to get towers down here, but still. So the Oog is going to come down from this lane next turn, basically. How exciting is that? So we don't want to extend any section down here, really, I guess. We need to get more ballistas down here too, but right now it's all attention on the mana. 41 per second and we're, we're actually killing it. We've only got two we've only got two towers that use mana, by the way, and we're shredding through 41 per second mana. This game's changed loads. Oh, it's so exciting. This is actually so exciting. Oh my God. We're doing well at the minute though. Everyone's getting shredded. Everyone's getting beamed. It's nice to see. We can get crit chance on the ballista soon as well. Just want to get all the base upgrades really done first. We need more mana banks, dude. I really don't want to put any more down. <laughs> Deal free damage to armor. It's got to be done. Ballista's getting upgraded again. We don't want to expand down here, so we're going to upgrade there instead. There comes the Ugi. He's a zombie Ugi. He's obviously not going to get targeted for a while. Park or cannon can hit him. Okay. I think we're going to be fine, honestly. He'll take damage from everyone else. Let, I'm not going to focus on the ballista targeting down here right now they'll sort it out themselves i'm pretty sure just focus on the mana 52 per second particle cannon i can see the particle cannon actually shredding through his shields we just keep upgrading you some more Look at it. Oh my god, it's it's actually chunking him. Like, it's it's ripping chunks out of his shield. This is insane. I 
Oh my god, he's dead. He's about to die. Oh, he's so close to die. Maybe the dot will kill him. Very slowly. I'm, I'm in shock. This is insane. There he is. He's going to die shortly. After the particle cannon just kills everybody else. Here we go. Let's go. Okay. Every enemy killed regenerates 1% max mana. Yes. Treasure chest open. All mana banks store an additional 15 mana. All obelisks deal one damage to health. You know what? Sure thing. Wow, let's expand this way. Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. It wraps around our starting point where I want to put more ballistas down. This is so good. This is actually so good. I'm so happy. I can't get one in there. That's really going to annoy me, actually. I can't fit one in there. Maybe if we move that out of the way, but let me put one down. This is, this is wild. How are we getting on up here? Okay, it looks like things are getting shredded. Nice. This is so good. Still need mana siphons, by the way. That would help a lot with the mana. Although we're doing good at the minute. I guess the yeah the life steal thing helped a bunch. All ballistas gain two range. It's got to be. I know I should be getting new towers, but when we can just keep upgrading the ballistas like this, that doesn't turn left. Wait, that looks way higher up. Plus seven. Yo. What are we gonna put on there? Could put an obelisk, you know, because the range would be huge. But then our mana is gonna get like shredded. Oh, let's do that. We can sort the mana out later on. Look at him go. Dude, this is insane. Look how cool this looks. This changes the game so much, dude. One more to go there and then really there, but it won't let us put one there. I might remove that mana bank and see if it lets me. All ballistas gain another two range. That over shields, I think. Yeah, honestly. Oh my god, there's another one. Oh, I might put that one as a particle cannon. Oh, oh, oh yes. Okay, let's target it to most shields. Let's upgrade its shield damage. This is wild. This is this is actually wild. I'm so happy. I know I keep saying it, but I'm just, dude, I'm so happy. What an update. All the towers. I say all the towers. These two towers look cooler. The ballistas fire rapidly. They're the only three towers we've got. So we haven't actually explored anything else yet. But I'm sure when we do, we'll find more changes. But I want to put some in here, but I can't see. <laughs> okay. Is there anything new? Oh, banditry free. Yeah, sorry. I want banditry free. Oh my god, another tower. What do we put on that one? I don't want to put another obelisk. I also don't want to put a ballista, really. It feels like a waste. I'm going to try and sell the mana bank. Oh. Put a ballista down. No, you can't. It doesn't let you. Now I can't put anything down there. Oh well. Okay. I guess I just want to put mana banks down. I got a lot of money, but I don't really know what. Oh, we should probably be upgrading, actually, shouldn't we? Let's upgrade these guys. You know, these guys deserve a lot of love. These obelisks, I haven't upgraded at all. All ballistas gain crit chance, or the. I'm going to get the crit chance on the ballistas, you know. I'm going to keep expanding this way. But I'm so hype. I'm starting to think I'm neglecting this side a lot. But they seem to be getting stuck here. So until they stop getting stuck here, like, <laughs> you know, I'm just going to let it do its thing. Try and get all these to 15, maybe. Try and balance it out a little bit. And I'll do the same to the other obelisk as well. I don't think it's the obelisks doing the most damage, though. Oh, we should have got mana. Look at our mana situation. 
I still think it's the ballistas dealing the most damage. Yeah, 100%. Look at them go. I want to get all these to 15. That's two obelisks. We need to get these guys upgraded as well. Particle cannons. We need to get... Oh, I want to try other towers. But I keep getting upgrades for the towers we've already got. So that seems more worth it to me. Okay, what have we got here? All ballistas deal free damage to shields. Like, why would I not take that, you know? Like, why would I not? I have to take that, really. Okay, it's just shield damage on this obelisk left upgrade to 15. You are targeting most shields, aren't you? I suppose their range isn't that big. I could kind of upgrade. I could do upgrading these and increasing their range a lot, actually. Probably need one up here as well, because we haven't got a particle, uh, particle cannon coverage up here. We're putting one on one of these like plus threes here so we can reach the whole of the northern section. Keep upgrading you. I want to make sure you are the same as the other obelisks so you can just shred together. Obelisks that shred together stay together. Okay, nice. Um, see, that's really good, right? That is like really good, but. 15 crit chance for the ballistas. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> yes. I should probably get some universities on these shrines as well. Get some upgrades, some passive upgrades. They'd be spending all my money, but same time, don't you think it's needed, you know? 36 shield damage or shield multiplier on that particle cannon. Okay, oh, I need to get mana banks. Yep, yep, sorry. Forgot about the whole mana situation. The mana crisis. The gang solves the mana crisis. Okay. Oh, dude, we're generating 89 per second and we we have four towers that use mana. It's insane how much this has changed. It's starting to get through a little bit more down here. They will still die though, of course, but they're making progress, which is never good. Seemed easy enough. All towers gain one damage to health. I feel like that's just like a thing that just is going to keep popping up now. Maybe I shouldn't choose that one. Way more towers down here, dude. Right, mana banks. Let's keep going. Let's make sure we don't run out because then we are doomed. Generating 111 per second. Obviously, the life steal's given us big bursts at a time, but. You need to make sure it's consistent. Obviously, I'd like to, I'd like it to remain like maxed out at all times, but I don't think it's going to be possible. Okay, big wave coming through here. Looks like we're dealing with it though. There's some bug with the sound. It sounds like whenever something is shooting, it cuts the music out, which is kind of funny. Um, okay, just more mana banks. Look at this, dude. We're making a whole mana factory down here. Oh, that's a bit better. That is like halfway through a round. Okay, we're definitely not going to use that, even though it would help. It's got to be all ballistas gain two range. I know we could siphon mana, but like these ballistas are going to become cracked. Like, you know. That's all I can think about right now is making the ballistas cracked, my dudes. There's so many shrines, so, so I do feel like I need to get universities down but at the same time like do i <laughs> well that's on a hill i don't want it on a hill that, that kind of ruins the aesthetic of my my big mana hall my big purple block at the start of the start of the the track dude look at this this is insane Okay, mana does seem to be doing well at the minute. Can't put any there or there. Go on there. Okay. This is ridiculous. 166 per second. Do you reckon that means we can put some more mana towers down? Or, you know, mana consuming towers down soon? Wait, are these all new ones? 
Let's get some shredders in. What do you reckon's changed to the shredders, everybody? They look exactly the same. Maybe they were, you know what? Maybe they weren't lying when they said shredders have received no change. Oh my god. See the size of that unit? Dude, the shredders are massive now. Look at them. Oh my god, they're huge. Let get a few of those down, I think. I don't think I want to upgrade them, though, is the thing. I know it sounds really bad, but like... Actually, I might upgrade this one. A lot of damage to health, but not a lot of damage to anything else. So I just want to upgrade his shield and his armor damage. Gonna get another one down here as well, somewhere. Doesn't need big range on it, because... Well, you know, it's a shredder. It doesn't really need to shoot long range. Okay, so shredders have just been made bigger, I guess. Seem to bounce back a lot as well down the lanes. Maybe they're just looking for new targets. Either way, I like it a lot. How's it going down here? And oh, it's oh my god, it's a noogie round. I didn't even realize it was a noogie round. Oh my god, the shredders came all the way for the Yugi. Look at this. This is chaos. Oh my god. He's about to die though. He only made it to there as well. That's huge for us. Definitely not getting that one. I'm going to get... Um, let's try Tesla coils for a bit. Chest open. All towers gain one damage to armor. See, I just feel that's a bit, a bit of a cop out really. Right, Tesla coils. One has to go on there. They look, they look a bit different. I feel like they don't look different at all. Hmm. Let's just get a few down in places where we know they're going to be, you know, used, I guess. They're not going to be great, let's be honest. I'm not going to go around and upgrade them all either, but... Oh, we can't even afford another one. <laughs> okay, now we can. 800 gold for another Tesla coil. I'll put one there, I think, maybe. Have they changed at all? Oh, look at their range. That's hit everybody inside it. That, that range is insane. Why is that range that big? I'm trying to figure out if it does damage to everybody in the circle or just people that hit the the outsides of it. I've got no idea what's going on. Okay, this must be the April Fool's update, dude. I, I don't understand it. There's no way this is now the real game. They actually did patch notes and actually... Oh my god. It's insane. Like, it's, it's insane. Oh. Oh, universities. Yes. Okay, let's get some universities down. Um, I guess just around these shrines, right? Um, we'll get three down. I feel like I just want to put... I want to, like... Because it costs the same, right? So I just want to uh, upgrade one for health, one for armor, one for shield kind of thing. That deserves a Tesla caller right there. I can't get over the, yeah dude they've definitely yeah he's not getting damaged so i just increased the size of it which really isn't that helpful okay university down here let's just only a 15 percent chance expanded learning achievement unlocked that's nice Dude, if this is an April Fool's update, I want it to stay. Like, please, forever. It's like, it's like a fun game mode or something. I actually read the patch notes and I was like, oh, that's quite funny. That's a cool joke. Not thinking it'd actually make the changes in-game. That's 15%. Let's get the monster magic studies to 15% as well. 
Nice. Always upgraded health in that one. Didn't mean to do that one. I'm sorry. Okay. All ballistas deal another 25% burn damage. Yes, please. I don't really know what's going on with the tester coils, but I do kind of want to put more down. <laughs> okay, back to here. Let's get you to like, what, 20% maybe? No one's made any studies yet. Okay, that's health studies at 20%. Oh, I read the wrong one almost. Monster armor studies next. This is so weird. Waves are starting to build up though, so I'm getting a little bit scared. Let's see how far they get here. I just spat my load more ballistas down, I think. Or just upgrade the other lists stats. Oh, they're actually getting places. Oh, we're in trouble. We, we've got banditry on as well with like no tower health right now. Like 20 tower health is nothing to banditry free on. It's like five enemies are going to kill us. So how do we fix this? Oh my god. Look at the actual... Oh my god. <laughs> What's going on? Okay, is more ballistas going to help? Do we need poison sprayers? All particle cannons. Actually, you know what? All obelisks deal two damage to health. I'm tempted to just upgrade this guy like to 20 all around and see if that makes a big difference. Spent a lot of money on that, so I'm going to hope that it does. Oh, there's our first portal down there. I feel like we upgraded an obelisk the other day, it didn't work, so I fell back on it again. Once again, the definition of insane is doing things exactly the same and expecting a different outcome. Uh, <laughs> okay. Is this going to help? Probably not. Let's think about upgrading this one as well. All these to, to 20. I think it's just a sheer amount because the obelisk is a single target. I think it's the issue more than it being a damage issue. I mean, the blisters are really good, but they've stopped getting upgraded now, which is another thing. I'm hoping this is going to help. If we can just keep upgrading these, but I, I honestly don't know. Seems to be working at the minute, actually, doesn't it? Better than last, uh, better than last turn, better than last level. That was easy, look. That's just down here. Oh my god. I love this whole ballista thing down here. This is the best map we could have got. Look at it go. Imagine if we had the ballistas use mana. <laughs> uh, all ballistas gain a 3% chance to freeze enemies. It's got to be done. It's got to be done. Okay, another portal down there. We're getting close. Okay, nice. Now this one is all at 21. Let's get this one all to 21 as well. Because they do upgrade their self, don't they? Which is how they got to level 21 in the first place over there. But I'm actually obsessed. <laughs> it's so good. Keep up. This bit is going to be fine, right? Let's be real. This this, this south section of the uh, this southern section of the builds, fine. Um, it's just this. Yeah. Obelisks do be shredding, but um, I mean, how many more upgrades can we do? You know, they're getting expensive. They're getting spenny. Maybe it's more obelisks. More ballistas, definitely, to be fair, but... Oh, no, this is it. This is, this is actually it here. Look at it. Okay, I'm literally upgrading this guy because he's the one that's closest. He's got to deal the damage. It's all on this obelisk at the minute. Completely lost my mouse cursor. Somehow I ended up on the other monitor. Kind of sus. Okay. I think this is fine. These guys have got the range to cope with this. 
Oh god. Okay, we're dealing with it this round. Next round's gonna be an issue though. Like a real big issue, you know. But to be fair, the ballistas are putting up a fight. Look at this. I don't know how we fix this though. Obviously, ballistas way further down the line would help because of the freezing and the slowing, but we can't really afford like afford them. I don't want to sell these ballistas because these are going to work. Like, they're kind of our saviors at the minute, these guys down here. Upgrade this guy to 22. Needs to be like really good tower upgrade now. Like on the next card upgrade please. I don't know what's going to help us that much. It's going to save our run but Okay honestly though that could help a lot right All obelisks deal 25% poison damage. May as well add it in you know. May as well Keep expanding this way. Nice The Ugi has to come from one of these routes though. That's the problem we're going to have This guy's going to be all 23 multipliers now. Do I think it's enough? No, I don't. What's this guy? This guy's almost all 23. Now he is. Okay. I just wish I could make the obelisk stronger a lot quicker. <laughs> it's going to happen again. We're going to get swamped over here. I need like huge AOE. Like huge like sprayers, but we didn't get any because I've been upgrading ballistas all game. Let's just start putting, honestly. I've just realized the ballistas damage doesn't matter to me anymore. It's just the slowing and the freezing that's gonna matter the most. Let's just get as many ballistas down as we can. Like, not just down here, but like let's let's, let's spread them around. Obviously, all around this. Look at all these little portal people coming through. These guys are like serious issues, these little portal people do. They let enemies out of them because they're little portal people. I like the big portals that we see down here, but they're like, they're little and they walk. I think we're dealing with it. Uh, okay, I might smoke a little bit too soon. To be fair though. Oh, I definitely spoke too soon. Oh no. Oh dude, no. Don't do this to me. Not like this. Not like this. Oh my God. Okay, come on, ballistas. Come on, hold down the fort. Come on. Nah, dude, we're dead. We're so dead. This, they're getting too close. Yeah, we're out. We got banditry free. Our health, our lives are just going to go. God damn it, dude. The little portal people. I, to be fair, I mean, look at the top of this. We had, what, four towers in the whole of the top section of the map? <laughs> I don't care, dude. That was fun. I don't care. That was really fun. It's, you know what? I don't care. It's, people are going to comment. Hey, man, you should really get more towers and upgrade the ones up north. Uh, dude, that was just too much fun. How could I not upgrade the ballistas nonstop like that when they're that strong? Same with the obelisks, dude. Look at the range on these guys. Especially that one. Well, thank you, everyone, for watching. Um, I will be back because this is genuinely insane. And I hope this update sticks around for a bit because I'd love to make more videos on it. Um... So yeah, make sure you subscribe, stay tuned in, um, stay tuned in for all the videos, you know, and all that kind of stuff, all the upcoming stuff, uh, daily videos, hopefully now, again, and uh, yeah, I'll see you all again next time, goodbye!